Sony Ejin is forever Valentino. Hey everyone, welcome back. This past few months, Sony Ejin rarely travels for work, but her photos have certainly gone places. After her photos were displayed in Milan, in the Mason Valentino flagship store, and in New York for Kofik or Korean Film Council 200 Actors campaign, and now Sony Ejin is included in Mason Valentino's largest exhibition and it is now displayed in Doha, Qatar until April 1, 2023. Based on the interview of Valentino Creative Director Pier Paolo Piccioli, curator Massimiliano Guioni, and journalist Alexander Fury, who curated the exhibition Forever Valentino in Doha, Qatar until April 1 of next year. That this is Valentino's largest exhibition in the Middle East, and Sonia Jin and Huasa's photos are also on display. According to Pier Paolo Piccioli, during his interview, Sonia Yejin and Huasa, who were with him on the Valentino journey, there is nothing more joyous than if people he really likes become witnesses of his work. They were also asked why they chose Doha, Qatar among many cities. And he said Doha, Qatar is a city of diversity and very receptive to new ideas. Geographically, it is also halfway between Asia and Europe, and above all, it is not a retrospective but a venue to present a perspective for Valentino's new vision. Actually, even though Sonia Jin is already pregnant, she is still really busy with many commitments, and we still see her photos in different parts of the world. That's the impact of Sonia Jin alone. Congratulations once again, Sonia Jin, on your new achievement. If you like this, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe till my next video. Thank you for watching.